Hello again, this is Ant-Man 29 Able. Uh, while I'm here in my bushland setting, waiting for my transpiration bag to start working, even though it's, um, I'm looking at a couple of books here and trying to identify some wild plants that I have in my local area. This first one here, Wild Food Plants of Australia by Tim Lowe. And the second one here, Australian Medicinal Plants by uh, E. Lessac and T. McCarthy. So, it's for Australian usage. Let's do the wild plants one first. In here, you can see it's got an introduction, how to use the book, habitats, uh, dangers of poisoning, plants, introduced food plants, mushrooms, foraging, cooking, bush survival, and so forth. So, it's um, dated 1988 and revised 1991 so I suppose it's still reasonably current plants don't change that much but inside it's a great book it has a colour photo short description of the plant and this in case it's uh, rainforest plants and more rainforest plants gives you a little map of showing you where you should be able to find them or therefore where not to be able to find them got some freshwater plants Plants along the seashore, so it's rated in different categories. And charts on nutrients, how much nutrients we can get out of, protein and so on. Foraging and cooking, different types of mushrooms. Uh, arid zone plants, what do you expect to find? Desert areas, forest type plants. Great book, I'm learning a lot from uh, this book and trying to identify plants. Australian medicinal plants. Uh, copyrighted here, we would say, I was reprinted a couple of times, copyrighted 2011. So it's reasonably current. Shows you plants to narcotics, painkillers, headaches, colds, tonics, antiseptics, skin disorders, miscellaneous cures and so forth so it's laid out fairly well a fair bit of reading but say it gives you the name of a plant and its um, family name and so forth its habitat medicinal uses so on a little bit more difficult to use because you need to know each plant what it actually looks like because there's not that many photos in here still a very interesting book of what's available in our local landscape Australian medicinal plants I got both these from uh, Survival Supplies Australia with Dennis the same as I got the transpiration bags from great guy to work with by all means if you're in Australia and need some uh, sort of products he sells a lot of other things to do with survival supplies and outdoors contact him Survival Supplies Australia the scent man Twin Enable, thanks for watching. Remember, stay prepared, be ready, be alert. It's endured, endure to the end. Take care and goodbye for now.